Hello again. In this video I am going to demonstrate methods of uploading a project to your PC from an HMI as opposed to download which is moving files from your PC to the HMI. Some of these methods include USB upload, utility manager, and from Easy Builder Pro. So let's get started. One of the most common methods of uploading a project from an HMI is through Easy Builder Pro itself. So we start out by opening an instance of Easy Builder Pro. Want to go to File and Upload. Designate the HMI type. Um, currently connected to a CMT3090. Select file location. I've got a uh, upload projects uh, folder on my desktop and uh, define the file name and we're going to call this uh, Upload one, click open, and then uh, you'll notice since I selected the correct type, it went ahead and found my CMT. If it didn't show up and you're sure you're connected, you could click search all and it should show there. You want to go ahead and make sure it's highlighted in blue and click upload. Now you can see it's finished. Now what this has done, it has uploaded a CXOB file. Now this is a compiled um, runtime file. This is the case in any method of upload. This is the file you get when you upload from the HMI. There's another step that needs to be taken to make this uh, editable file. So we want to go ahead and open an instance of Easy Builder Pro again. And then again go to File and Decompile. Find our file and select it. And uh, here it will automatically put the file in the same file location but if you wanted it in a different uh, location you could put it here. Now the default uh, password is six ones one 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 uh, but if you know that to be different on your particular project then of course you would need to change that there. And then just go ahead and click decompile and you can see here it's done so we can exit out of here, go to file and open, and uh, of course here's our project. And uh, there it is. It's just that simple. So uh, it's uh, almost the same method. Let me go ahead and, uh, well I can leave that because I'll just do a different file name. Um, now from the utility manager, to your Easy Builder Pro folder and uh, Utility Manager. And on the Publish tab, Upload. There we go, I found it. Change that to uh, 2. Click Upload. Exit. Exit out of there. And then go through the same process in Easy Builder Pro to decompile it. And it would decompile the project. 
Now let's move on to uh, USB upload. Uh, go ahead and log in. Select the disk one file. Click OK. Upload. Now this takes a few seconds. File for you. Now it's stopping the project. And there you go, it's finished. We'll wait for our project to uh, reboot. And now we can go ahead and unplug the flash drive. So I'm going to go ahead and uh, plug the flash drive into my PC now. And of course, see here's our data log, event log files, recipe, data, and all that, which there wasn't any in the project. Now, of course, here is our uh, CXOB file. And of course, we use the same method to decompile, but I'll go ahead and uh, show you that. take a little tad longer because it's writing it to the flash drive rather than my local hard drive. And now it's done. So we can exit out of there. And here we're in see uh, the flash drive. Here's our project. And there it is. Thanks for watching and be sure to come back and see more of our instructional videos.